Hello, as you've seen on the pictures uh, in front of this video, I had a little fire on with my small 48 uh, volt battery pack. And uh, this is what happened. I, uh, but the, the stupidest thing was that I disconnected the discharge function on the BMS because uh, this battery pack uh, it, uh, could, could handle 400 amps and uh, the VMS only 200 and then it shut down and then uh, when I was testing the electric rock roller uh, the VMS shut down with the first test so I disconnected the discharge function and put the uh, uh, minus uh, direct to the battery but I kept uh, the VMS when I charged the battery but uh, I got some enthusiastic and uh, as I drove, I didn't have uh, ice on the, the voltage on the battery, so I got below uh, 3 volts, I think it was, and then uh, the battery caught fire. And as you can see, it's uh, quite destroyed. The cells took fire one after another, and now I'm trying to save as many cells as I can. This is this uh, AIG pouch model. And uh, I put them I took them from uh, microvet Fiat microvet car. And uh, but they are quite expensive so I must try to salvage as many as I can. Then I'm gonna build a forest battery for a quite big drone my son is building with uh, this NASA GDI uh, GPS function going to be quite nice, I think. But um, yes, this is what happens if you don't uh, use your BMS the correct way. Thank you.